Hey everybody, Ricky Adam handicapping thoroughbred racing from my hometown track, Penn National Racecourse, Granville, Pennsylvania on Friday night, May the 20th. This is my dayatthetrack.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 5 this evening, folks. 7.38 p.m. Eastern Post Time, 8.5 furlong route test on the dirt, 3 year olds and up race for an allowance purse of some $32,000. Contenders number 3, Extreme Dream. Number 4, Bird's ID. Number 1, Mystic Harbor. And number 2, Graziano. Number 3, Extreme Dream, takes a class drop of 9 units as the overall speed leader in this allowance field, racing at or about this evening's distance of 8.5 furlongs on the dirt. Comes off a Comes off five straight power run performances, hitting the board in four of those adventures, including a pair of power run wins being embedded in this recent streak of racing consistency. Jockey Angel Arroyo and trainer John Service send them postward for the Friday night feature. They've hit the board with 57% of their entry saddle as a team to date. Number four, Bird's Idea, has hit the board in four straight, including a pair of wins found in his last start as well as in his third race back. Race 5 summary, number 1, excuse me, number 3, Extreme Dream, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 4, Bird's ID, number 1, Mystic Harbor, and number 2, Graziano, 3, 4, 1, 2, and the 5th from Penn Nat. Bonus long shots, let's go to Mountaineer Park first, Chester, West Virginia, race 6, number 2, Speedball, 9 to 2 shot, better speed racing at tonight's distance of a mile on the dirt than the favorite, number 6, Mark Jumps. Prairie Meadows, Altoona, Iowa, race four. Number seven, Wando Venture, a 10 to 1 bomb, drops in class by nine units, is the speed leader in this claiming field, sprinting at six furlongs on the dirt. So from Penn National on a Friday night, or a better place to be on a Friday night, Rick Needham. For dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.